Have you ever questioned yourself if life is a simulation? Delve into the unsettling truth that you may be part of a simulation? But here's the catch. You're not supposed to know it. Keep watching to discover the clues that support the idea that you are living in a simulation. Our perception of reality is like a hologram shaped by how we see things. This idea connects with what scientists call quantum physics. It suggests that what we see around us might not be as solid as it seems. Instead, it's like a movie playing out based on how we observe it. Sometimes, powerful people use something called predictive programming. It's a way to influence what many people think or do by showing them certain ideas over and over again. This can make people agree with things without even realizing it. Think about how often you hear the same message repeated in the media or by influential figures. This repetition isn't by chance. It's a way to mold our thoughts and beliefs, steering us in certain directions without us even realizing it. This manipulation of our perceptions is a key tool in shaping the reality we think we know. It's time to break free from the control others try to have over us. We each have the power to shape our own reality. When we reject the ideas forced upon us by those in power, we take back control of our lives. Imagine a world where everyone thinks for themselves, where we don't just follow the crowd. This is the world we can create when we refuse to give our consent to the agendas of the elite. By standing up for what we believe in, we disrupt their plans and pave the way for a better future. We all possess a unique strength within us, a power that goes beyond what we can see or touch. When we awaken to this inner strength, we challenge the established systems of control. It's like unlocking a hidden potential that has been dormant within us all along. This journey towards individual sovereignty is not easy. It requires courage and determination to break free from the chains of manipulation. But with each person who wakes up to their own power, we move closer to a world where everyone is free to create their own reality. Have you ever felt like you've experienced something before, even though it's happening for the first time? That feeling is called déjà vu. It's like a glitch in the matrix, a momentary glimpse into the possibility that time isn't as linear as we think. Déjà vu isn't the only strange phenomenon that hints at the possibility of time loops or distortions within our perceived reality. Some people report experiencing recurring patterns or events that seem to repeat themselves in strange ways. These anomalies challenge our understanding of time and suggest that there might be hidden layers to our existence. Think about it like this. If reality is like a computer program, then déjà vu and time loops could be like bugs in the code. They're little clues that hint at the underlying structure of the simulation we're living in. But what does this mean for us? It means that our perception of time and reality might not be as straightforward as we once thought. It opens up a world of possibilities and challenges us to rethink what we know about the nature of existence. Throughout history, civilizations have explored the depths of consciousness and reality, often reaching levels of understanding that challenge our modern beliefs. Ancient cultures like the Egyptians, Greeks and Mayans had a profound grasp of spiritual and technological concepts that rival our own advancements. For instance, ancient Egyptian teachings on the nature of the soul and its journey after death parallel modern theories in quantum physics about the interconnectedness of all things. Similarly, Greek philosophy delved into questions of existence and consciousness 
that resonate with our current exploration of the mind and its relation to reality. Hermetic teachings, originating from ancient Egypt and Greece, emphasize the principle of as above, so below, suggesting a fundamental unity between the macrocosm of the universe and the microcosm of the individual. This idea aligns with modern scientific theories about the holographic nature of reality and the interconnectedness of all things. Furthermore, quantum physics has revealed startling parallels between ancient mysticism and modern science. Concepts like non-locality, where particles can instantaneously influence each other regardless of distance, echo ancient spiritual teachings about the interconnectedness of all beings. The placebo effect, where belief in a treatment's effectiveness can lead to actual physiological changes, underscores the power of consciousness in shaping our reality. This insight resonates with ancient practices of healing through rituals and intention. Rituals are more than just ceremonies. They're tools used by elites to shape our thoughts and behaviors. Through subtle messages and symbols, rituals can influence both individuals and entire societies. Take the 2012 Olympic ceremony, for example, which many believe contained hidden messages about future events. These rituals create a sense of unity and identity among participants, but they also serve a darker purpose, to maintain control over the masses. The elite use education, news and religion to perpetuate their power, keeping us in a state of submission. By controlling the flow of information, they manipulate our perceptions of reality, making us believe what they want us to believe. But awareness is the first step to breaking free from their grasp. By recognizing these manipulative tactics, we can reclaim our autonomy and create a more enlightened society. We're often led to believe that we're merely mortal beings, bound by the limitations of our physical bodies. But what if I told you that we're more than just flesh and bone? The truth is, we possess an immortal essence, a spark of divinity that transcends the confines of time and space. The elite understand this truth all too well. They exploit our fear of death and ignorance of our true nature to maintain control over us. By keeping us focused on the material world, they divert our attention from the spiritual realm within. But awakening to our immortal self is the key to breaking free from their manipulation. When we realize that our essence is eternal, fear loses its grip on us. We no longer submit to their authority, knowing that our true power lies within. Each of us holds the potential for greatness, capable of creating a reality beyond the control of the elite. By embracing our immortal nature, we reclaim our sovereignty and pave the way for a brighter future for all humanity. Imagine a world where every individual is empowered to manifest their deepest desires and aspirations. This is the world we can create when we liberate ourselves from societal distractions and elite agendas. By freeing ourselves from the constraints imposed upon us by external influences, we tap into the boundless potential of our imagination and assumption. Through the power of visualization and positive thinking, we can transcend the limitations of our human experience, unlocking doors to personal and collective evolution. But individual empowerment is just the beginning. As each person awakens to their inherent power, a ripple effect is created, igniting a collective shift towards truth and empowerment. This collective awakening has the potential to reshape the fabric of society, ushering in an era of harmony, cooperation, and abundance for all. Have you ever found yourself pondering the mysteries of existence? 
Questions about free will, determinism, and the nature of reality can lead us down a rabbit hole of philosophical inquiry, challenging our understanding of the world around us. Consider the concept of free will. Are our choices truly our own, or are they predetermined by external factors beyond our control? This dilemma forces us to confront the idea that our lives may be governed by forces beyond our comprehension. Similarly, the debate between determinism and randomness raises profound questions about the nature of causality and the universe's underlying order. Are events predetermined by a cosmic script, or do they unfold according to random chance? And then there's the nature of reality itself. Is what we perceive as real truly objective, or is it merely a construct of our consciousness? This question forces us to consider the possibility that our reality may be nothing more than an illusion, a simulation created by unknown forces. In our journey through life, we encounter limitations and boundaries that shape our perceptions and experiences. These constraints serve as reminders of the simulated nature of our reality, hinting at the underlying mechanisms that govern our existence. Consider the limitations of memory. Despite our best efforts to retain information, our memories are fallible and subject to distortion. This fragility suggests that our perception of the past may not be as reliable as we believe, raising questions about the true nature of time and memory within the simulation. Similarly, cognitive biases and perceptual limitations influence how we interpret the world around us. Our brains are wired to filter information based on preconceived beliefs and expectations, creating a subjective reality that may differ from objective truth. Our sensory perceptions are limited by the constraints of our biological senses. We can only see a narrow spectrum of light, hear a limited range of frequencies, and feel a restricted range of sensations. These limitations create a narrow window through which we perceive the world, obscuring the true nature of reality. As we navigate the intricacies of our perceived reality, it's crucial to remain open to the possibility that we are living in a simulation. This realization challenges us to question the authenticity of our experiences and encourages us to seek truth beyond the veil of illusion. Awakening to the possibility of our simulated existence requires courage and a willingness to challenge deeply ingrained beliefs. It involves peeling back the layers of deception woven into the fabric of our reality and confronting the uncomfortable truths that lie beneath. This journey towards enlightenment is not one that we must embark on alone. By fostering a community of truth seekers and open-minded individuals, we can support one another in our quest for understanding. Together, we can share insights, challenge assumptions, and uncover the hidden truths that lie buried beneath the surface of our perceived reality. If you're still watching, I'd like to thank you for your attention. If you enjoyed the content and want to see more, please consider clicking the subscribe button. Your support is very appreciated. Feel free to share your experiences or thoughts in the comments below. Until next time, take care and stay tuned for more insightful content.